Okay, in this series of videos, I'm, I'm reading from a document, but um, more and more people have become aware of the straw man deception. It's been talked about now for a number of years. I know I first began to understand it in 1996 when I was living in Canada. There are groups out there now who are studying it and, and helping people to um, redeem their straw man. There's been a lot of speculation, a lot of conspiracy theory thrown around and a lot of scoffing, of course. This document that I, I'm reading ties it all together and proves absolutely that the things that you've been hearing and the things that we've certainly been revealing and sharing are the absolute truth and is the reason why they, the bankers, want you dead. The straw man, the certificate, the birth certificate system with your birth certificate number there, that is the 666 of the buying and selling. Um, and the straw man is known as the agent in commerce. You cannot buy or sell without the straw man. Well, what we haven't known is a, that we've had one, and, and B, that the government was actually con in, in control of it rather than ourselves. The redemption is taking back control over our agent in commerce, which is called the straw man, the 666. This scenario here just lays it all down. It, it, it explains it very thoroughly, not only what they did, but how they do it and how they get away with it. They're relying on our passivity and they're relying on our death through the birth certificate. The birthing certificate is actually our death warrant. That's how they make, they already own most of the planet. They, um, that's how they've stolen our inheritance and our time. Because really they can't take anything else from us. Our time is the only thing that we can give them. And that's what we've been duped into giving them. Through the enforced labour, uh, the need to support ourselves, to be paying taxes, of course, which are going straight to them. How many times have I heard, well, we all have to pay taxes that builds infrastructure and this and that. No, it doesn't. None of that. It all goes straight to them. What builds infrastructure is the uh, monies from our straw man account. Upon our demise, our death, when our relatives are burying us, they've already looted the straw man account and that goes into the general revenue to build infrastructure. So this is probably the um, culmination, really, of all the videos that Brian's put together all these years, proving who he is, revealing the deception right from the beginning. For decades he's been telling us we're deceived and that their plan is to kill us. It's the divine revelation to the divine. Human beings are divine. Yes. So don't be surprised that I come along and tell you who I am because you're my offspring. That's right. Mankind, you are divine. Mankind is the offspring of God. And it's the devil's in control who would have you believe otherwise that you're nothing more than animals with two hands to serve them and that you're deserving of death, according to them. Well, you, you can't kill God, but you have to know that you're God first of all so that you know that they can't kill you. Well, that's where you gain Im immortality. Yes. A realisation that you are. That's right. And uh, then nothing can by any means hurt you. So, you know, for the irritation that we might be to those out there who, who uh, scoff and abuse and get offended, remember, the Christ is the rock of offence, um, it's because of the stupidity that you've all been educated into and, and gone along with and refused to wake up from when presented with evidence that you refuse to even look at. That's, that's the, uh, with the head in the sand bit. Major brainwashing. Yeah, totally. And the voice of reason. Where all do you learn all this? Your school teachers. I have one in mind, as a matter of fact. Well, all school teachers are <laughs> in the same. It just might be the, you know, the epitome of a great school teacher, however. Who was that? 
<laughs> you can say the name. Well, Benjamin Blake. He's a marvelous school teacher. He's awesome. However, it's dangerous he's to the very freedom. Dangerous, man. dangerous to the freedom of future generations and his own children. Mm -hmm. And he and all like him, whether you're a teacher or not. Parents, if you preventing your children knowing that Jesus Christ is back and uh, stopping them from coming to him, which is exactly what he said not to do in the first thing. You know, <laughs> suffer not the little children to come unto thee, for such as theirs belongs the kingdom of God. Well, every child should have a mass walk out and strike, sit down. Mm. So I'm not going back to school till you get this straightened out. Yes. That's, actually, until they put you on the throne, the whole world should strike. Mm, go on, strike. Because who else is going to sort until it out? Until you get your Lord and King and Master, if yeah. you want to call me that. I'm your servant. That's right. I'm not your master at all. No. I'm here to do it right for you. To save you. It's, this, it's your salvation. You. That's right. That's why we're both here. It's your salvation. And uh, the powers that be know that he's here. They've done everything in, within their power to prevent the masses from knowing that he is. Now put God on the throne. The devil is on the throne. We're in hell and the devil is in control. So go on strike. Go on strike. To not a hand. To any just go on strike. Whole world. Go on strike until God is sitting on his throne, which is the throne of England. That is the throne of David. It's his son of David. The Lord Jesus Christ is sitting behind this camera. Give him back his throne. Elizabeth, your time is up. Charles, Philip, oh my god, I have not seen him an uglier demon than, than Philip in his old age. <laughs> yeah, he's a bad man. And William, sorry dear, you're not the Christ. There's all these little vids out there trying to convince people or, or, or what the evil schemes put are. It, put it this way, William, your father and your grandfather killed your mother. Killed your mother. Your mother who was... Um, Lovely woman. She was God's kid. Your mother was righteous. She was also uh, the bloodline that was closest to that of the royal bloodline of King David. And is why she was chosen to bring forth you uh, the deception. So now it's your choice. You can go either one way or the other. Mm. Go towards truth or you go towards the uh, epitome of evil, the mm. Freemasonry. Yeah. So that's what these series of vids are about. And um, it's up to humankind, mankind to ask. It's no good sitting back saying, well, you know, what can we do? You can do a lot. They fear resistance. They fear this knowledge getting into the hands of, of the people, into the minds of the people, and they fear your resistance. They fear a coup. They fear... Now, when Chavez was stolen from the people those years ago, it was through the people rising up and saying, no, we want our peasant president back we elected him and they walked hundreds of thousands of them walked to the palace none of them were armed at all they were not angry that's Chavez. that's Chavez yeah they, they walked to the palace and the army saw them coming the army in their arms and the army were the one that went oh my god and they didn't about turn they went inside and brought out the the the, the criminals who'd been put in by the United States and his tie and all the rest of it. And within 48 hours, Chavez was flown in in a helicopter. He was back because the people demanded that he be brought back. <laughs> but Chavez has said at the UN after yes. he got on a podium after Bush was there, they could smell the sulfur. Sulfur. The devil's been here. I can smell the sulfur. And it's in this place. Totally right. So. So they're like, targeting him for the next earthquake. Yeah. So, it's up to people, it's up to the masses. Tell everybody. Strike. Strike, and that the Christ is back, and he is telling everybody to stop. Stop paying your mortgages. Stop doing everything. Stop buying Shell and Mobile and BP. Right. You don't... Oh. Buy off the small people. Yeah, the mums and dads, the pops. Mm. Go to your farmers, go to your neighbours, go to those. Exchange, yeah, organic food. exchanging goods and, and, and doing what used to be done before, before they took.